dangerous. You know I need to travel alone. I'll serve you in Thanks to you, we finally done some damage to the corporation. Don't go out. Whatever you do, don't go near the mines. I'm not afraid. I'm catching a scrap shuttle. Take what I need for expenses and travel. Use this to buy your own passage. Then give the rest of the rebellion. I thought you sold out Brinkman. Planet. But what about Duran? Look at you heard me now. Move it. <laughs> not here. Laura, darling, I need to know the whereabouts. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. Did, did that hurt? I'm sorry. I really am. You see Carmen here? Now, she is a nasty looking bitch, isn't she? You've made a big mistake, honey. Expecting some action? I just need to be ready. So, you ready to talk to me now? The last time I saw him was years ago. He was running from something. From what? I don't know. Just like the old days. You do make a hell of a team, you know. Sonny Williams, Bobby's brother. <sighs> Laura, do you have any idea who Bobby might be involved with or could have done this? Brinkman practically controls the entire planet. He has every politician. He didn't really steal from him. Brinkman has slaves working for him in the mines. If you have managed to escape, they can feel they expand. Android. They're part human, part cyborg. Random synthetic germ combat. The body's riding away. So where does this guy... But it's been 14 years. And Brinkman has no plans of keeping his end of the bargain. I mean, he's even developed software that numbs their senses. Deep down, they're no less human than you or I. He helped us free some of the slaves. He was a hero. A hero? Look, Bobby may have had Brinkman's office and kill him. I mean, you'll be dead before you get through the first door. Maybe. Do you have it? Well, I have what? <gasps> no, uh, no, no. Well, you are a bitch, Carmen. I wouldn't have you any other way. Called me an ugly bitch. Well, now that's just plum rude. <laughs> What happened to you? I'll get some ice. Uh, what have you gotten yourself into this time? I think I infiltrated Bobby's gang. A nice gang. Oh, no, 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 no. They're not the ones that did this. Any more of Bobby's business associates you neglected to tell me about? That should about do it. Oh, don't get too comfortable. Come on, we gotta get going. Wait a minute. I'm cozy. Well, she's got a point to answer. What about you? You got a place to go? Yeah, don't worry about me, Sonny. My friend's got me set up at a place in the strip. Cool. So you'll be all right? Did you have a good time last night? <laughs> 
jealous? Of you? Don't laugh yourself. Listen, Laura speaks pretty highly of this Tarmac character. I think we could trust what she says. She's okay. Seems he's come up with a new energy source. Tarmac says it's as powerful as a gamma crystal. A level eight gamma crystal. What? Says Brinkman's planning on selling it as a weapon. How do you find this out? I don't know. He didn't go into details, but uh, he said he saw Brinkman use it on a cyborg slave. So how can we help? Help? This doesn't change anything, Dancer. They chose to be cyborgs. They got screwed. That's life. There's no point in me being dragged down with them. Sonny, these are people. They're humans. If you want to go join their cause, feel free. That's not why I'm here. Sonny, when you were with the agency, you would have done everything in your power to help these people. What happened to you? That was a long time ago, Dancer. Maybe I got tired of, of fighting lost cause. Maybe I got smart. No, you've changed, and not for the better. Bobby, but next time... Get the hell out of here. But Mr. Brinkman doesn't want you hurt. He's the bastard who killed Bobby! He is just a goon. Brinkman is the man behind Bobby's death. He's behind all of this. Are you all right? I am so sick of these creeps invading my place. I don't, don't expect too much. I wanted you to see this. I'm here. Your brother really came through for us. That was his money. So what's the plan? We use those credits to bribe our way into the mining complex. Then what, we find the cyborgs and lead them out? man I wouldn't go shopping around for a snow cone for being set up well we need to help them then I don't think that's a good idea we shouldn't get in the middle of this thing we are in the middle of this Sonny look you do what you want I'm going back in there Clara. Sonny I gotta go I'm going Danny luck will have new information in the morning there's nothing more we can do now you might as well call him and get some sleep Man. Time's up, Bobby boy. Oh, my word. You see, now you've upset. Thank you. So, you two were in the agency together? Yeah, we met when we were in the training program and then spent the next six years together as partners. Till Sonny quit. Why'd he quit? We were on a mission that turned into a mess. We were the only two to come out of it alive from this failure and decided to call it quits. Why'd you leave? Sonny and I were partners. I, I felt I couldn't be uh, effective without him. Were you two ever, you know, a couple? <laughs> it's never quite that simple. Somebody please get me a drink. Here. It's horrible. Single mom, you're an angel. We should get him a doctor. Yeah. Oh, I'm fine. And maybe a round the clock nurse will do then. That won't be necessary. You know that guy that was here? The guy that killed Bobby? My job's done. Do what I came to do. And you fought this long and hard just to walk away, just to serve yourself? Yeah. yeah. I'm kidding. Did you get the explosives? Yeah. These are the most powerful explosives you can find. And they fit in your pocket. You got radius. I guess that's it. So what do we do now? We wait. Uh -huh. 
Are you coming? All right. You and your army wait here. I'm gonna need a little time to disengage the security. If I can't do it, I'll let you know with this. Abort the mission. If it stays neutral, you don't hear anything from me, you're in the clear. Got it? Yeah. You're a good man, Sonny. Just like your brother, Bobby. Yeah, well, don't thank me yet. Good luck. Let's go, Dancer. Come on now, Bill. If you wear the poor girl out, there'll be nothing left for me. You saw her? Where is she? Bobby will be arriving any minute now. Okay, it's time. You have to be shit quiet. Don't say anything. I'm getting you out of here. Someone's coming. <laughs> Tyra, time to settle. Bobby boy. Get nice and tight. Thanks to you and your brother. Aw, poor baby. 